Hey gang, it's your old pal Jared again coming at you from Tavares. Man, excellent day of hydrocross racing. Saturday racing is done. Moto2 is complete. Meet the new boss, same as the old boss. Eric Degler goes two for two today in the pro sport class. Eric, I tell you, I was watching, you know, we talked earlier about the Joker buoy and the strategizing behind that. Looked like you took it a little bit earlier today, and I think that threw with some of the guys, because then they had to shift their strategy, and I think they took that buoy a little bit earlier, too. Were you thinking about that? Were you thinking maybe they would follow me, or you just go out there and make it happen? No, I changed it up on the second lap. I uh, looked at the second place guy, and I knew that he would get in front of me, but I was looking at the spacing between the second and third place guy, and I figured if I ran into the Joker buoy, made a hard run, and then ran back to the course that I'd be able to get in front of him, and then that's what I did. And then I was able to catch up to the leader, and then I knew he had to take the Joker buoy at some time. So when he did, that put me back out front. So uh, the boat was very fast today, very, very good HX. Well, this is a rough water. It's a big lake. We're used to racing on rivers, and I just spoke with our defending champion, Kyle Hayes, and this is pretty big water out here. Is this something you're used to? Do you like the rough race, or would you prefer glass-like and just be able to dump the throttle, or do you like catching some air every now and then? Uh, I like it all because when it gets rough, it's the equalizer. Um, you have to stay on your boat. Obviously, when you're on glass, it's easier to stay on the ski, so it takes a lot more skill, and it's really hard to keep the hammer down and uh, run fast out there when it, when it starts getting choppy. I noticed on the back stretch, I was getting a lot of boat wake, and uh, once or twice, I almost went over to handlebars. Uh, so I had to slow it down a little bit when I saw that weight coming across the course. So uh, all in all, it was a really good day. The boat ran good. Good fleet of drivers, a lot of good racing. LCQ is coming up tomorrow, fans. It's Eric Degler, man. He's our points leader right now in the championship points, going two for two. We got one more race for him to race tomorrow. Thank you. I'm glad to be here. And guys, come out. This is a great series. Hey, before we go, before we go, that reminds me, Eric. Uh, tell me about some of your sponsors. Do you have anybody you'd like to thank helping you get here? Uh, yeah, Extreme Throttle. Dave Godding. He's uh, helped me out a lot. Chris Hyslop uh, actually helped me set up this boat back in New Jersey. And uh, Brad Nickerson and um, Derek Rabolski from Jet Set Performance has helped me out. So a lot of guys have uh, touched this boat. I'm running Judge Carbs on it, so Judge has a lot to do with that boat, too. So all in all, there's probably at least five or six people that have helped me get where I am. So I really appreciate it. Well, where he got was P1 for tomorrow. This is Eric Degler starting on the pole tomorrow here in Tavares.